Hey, what's up everyone? Today we're gonna to be trying the build a starter home with 100 wood and five stone challenge. Uh, this challenge was originally submitted by YouTube user Splash Opain. I'll put them up on the screen. Be sure to go over, check out their channel, give them a like and a subscribe. If you decide to do this challenge as well, just let me know down in the comments. I'd love to see what you come up with in your builds. So it's 100 wood in the challenge. You have to have a workbench, a bed, a chest, and a fireplace. I already put my materials in here for the fire. That's included in the 100 wood. So that leaves you with only 70 wood to build your structure. Let's get right into it. All right, first I'm just gonna start off with some short walls, make this two by two. I did practice a few times. I tried a few uh, different versions and this is what I came up with. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, we'll see what you guys think. So, it's just a two by three footprint, which is kind of what a lot of people are coming up with. I'm not putting in a floor because that just goes right through all of your materials. One of these here, and that's just so that I can offset and overhang this roof a little bit. We'll go just two, and then I want a little overhang in the front as well. So we're just gonna come one more over this way. Let's see, here and one here, there we go. So already I'm down to 36 wood, so that uses about half of everything, although I don't need this here. Next, I'm going to go ahead and put in my workbench. I just want to fit it right here in the corner. There we go. Fit in this chest right by it. Nice and tidy. And then, just to mark things for a moment, I'm going to put this here, grab my bed. All right, so we have all of that. Now I'm going to take the this piece out. Let's see if that falls or not. I think it should be okay. And then um, we have our basic structure. I mean, I think technically at this point I could put a fire in it, but when it rains, the fire will go out. Um, one of the requirements is that your fire does need to be able to withstand a thunderstorm without going out. Uh, also, you know, you can't get smoked out by the fire. If you're being smoked out, then you probably need to rethink your fireplace. Um, cool little trick is that this will actually prevent the rain from putting out your fire. So um, even though it looks like it shouldn't, it, you know, Valheim logic, it works. These here and one of these here. At this point, I mean, we pretty much have everything done. We've got 35 wood left, so I'm just going to try to make the front look a little nicer. Try to just angle it out a little bit like this. And then I am going to this guy here. There we go. I don't really need this piece up here. Get my wood back. I will be using every last piece out of this 100. 100 wood does not go a very long way. And then I'm just gonna angle a few pieces of roof um, up in here. So start there, one angle over, put it here, here. There we go, and then I don't need this little piece and this little piece, so I'm gonna take that back for myself something kind of nice on the back so it looks decent. And another one of these, see if we can get it to snap. There we go. wood left so I know that part of that is my fire. Alright, 
so I can stand here, I won't get smoked. The smoke will go right out that top. I don't need this wall here. Just put a couple of pieces on the front, just for a little decoration. And that's it, guys. Um, so we'll run in here. You can see I can use the workbench and repair everything. Uh, the chest is functional. The bed I can sleep in. And I'm not getting smoked out. All right, so here we are. We're in the base, um, in the little starter house. It's storming out there, going full blast. Fire staying lit, no problem. Um, getting a little rested bonus, that's nice. And that's it, guys. That's the build. So uh, let me know what you think in the comments, and I can't wait to see what you guys build. We'll see you next time.